every single thing you do in life either makes you better or makes you worse. There's no standing still in life. Everybody wants to level up physically, financially, spiritually, mentally, overall better health. But what actions are, are you taking every single day to improve? Now let's focus especially physically and financially. Every day you take action. It's either going to make you better physically and richer financially. Today let's talk about the physical for a second. Look out here on the beach. Now some people are making themselves better physically and improving their health out here on the beach. They're walking, some people jogging, some people surfing. And that's gonna improve themselves physically. It's gonna make them healthier. But there's some people out here that's getting drunk, that's overeating on greasy fried food and other processed food and gorging themselves and won't get proper sleep tonight. They'll party to three or four or five in the morning. And that's gonna hurt themselves. They're gonna hurt themselves physically. They're gonna take a back step. They're gonna backslide in terms of good health. But it's our choice. We can improve our health or make it worse. Same beach, same opportunity. It's all about what you want to do. And there's some people that's just going to be sedentary on the beach. There's nothing wrong with relaxing. But you can't sit too long. You got to keep moving. You got to keep the blood flowing. So, I mean, that's, that's important to know. Same day, same beach. Some people make a good decision to improve themselves, and some people make a bad decision. Now, financially, <clears throat> some people will check out their investments, strategize today, look at the stock market, look at the crypto market. Look at their monthly budget. Decide how much money they're going to save today. How much money they're going to invest today. That's going to improve their finances. That's going to improve their lifestyle. But then there's some other people that's going to decide to go shopping for things they don't need overspend on luxury goods to try to impress other people going into debt to impress other people same day but two different decisions one will improve your finances the other one will destroy your finances <clears throat> either get better or you get worse there's no standing still. Money never sleeps. Money doesn't stand still. You could look up the price of Bitcoin right now. 24 hours is trading. The money is still moving. Bills are still coming due. Dividend checks are still being paid. Passive income is being made. 
money never sleeps. So your financial situation is either getting better or it's getting worse. You can't ignore it. Your health is either getting better or getting worse. You can't ignore it and just wait for the doctor to give you some pills <clears throat> or the doctor to tell you what's wrong. You have to be actively learning and about your health and how to improve it. You have to actively exercise, moving every single day, learning about your health. You have to be your own doctor somewhat. And just depending on the formally educated doctors to when you need a little bit of expertise, but you, you need to learn. We need, it's like driving a car. <clears throat> sure, you go to the mechanic if you think something's wrong, but you need to read the manual too on how to operate your car. And it would be smart to learn as much as you can about your car, about how to take care of it. Almost just as much as a mechanic would know, if not more than what a mechanic would know. Same with our bodies. We have to learn just as much about our bodies as a doctor would know. Why wouldn't you want to know just as much, if not more, about exercise and nutrition than a doctor would know? It's your body. Nobody's going to care about your health as much as you. And since our body is the only one that we have in this lifetime, there's nothing that we should not be willing to do. We should be willing to do anything to maintain it and make it last and be as as healthy as it can be, as strong as it can be for the rest of our lives. <clears throat> Same with money. It's okay to see a financial advisor, professional, but you need to learn about money, become just as much of a financial expert as a financial advisor. And maybe consult with one for you know, extra advice, bounce some ideas off. But don't just leave it up to a financial advisor to take care of your retirement or your your income, your wealth building. Nobody's going to care about your money more than you. And money is just as important as oxygen. You can't move. You can't leave the house without money. You basically can't survive in the world that we live in without money. Every time you walk out the house, it costs money. Just to stay in the house, it costs money. So every day, do something to improve your health and improve your wealth because it's only going to keep getting better or it's going to get worse. Health and wealth doesn't stand still. It's just like this ocean. It's going to keep flowing. It's going to keep moving every day. It's not going to be stagnant. Every day do something to get better. Physically and financially. Keep growing. Keep getting stronger. Keep getting richer. Every single day.